uh, growing up, Vela, my family was uh, a family that played a lot of music in the house. My father um, was into a lot of reggae and a lot of alternative from Europe. He also listened to that. Played a lot of American 90s R&B, Aliyah, R. Kelly, Jodeci, Puff Daddy, and the likes on top. And that's how I got introduced to music. Becoming an artist, there was a guy on the street, Bambiza Tan, to go by the name Crazy Rhymes. He was a hip hop artist. And I used to look up to him a lot because he was he was very unique, you know, because hip hop was something new to us in the mid 90s. Over. So guys like Botami, when we saw them in the hood, they represented, you know, something new and fresh that we we didn't know. Over. So he really played a big role. Yeah, so that's how I, I got into the hip hop. Um, I think Omojaji goes by Mugwanji. Yeah, yeah, yeah. People don't know he's one of the best rappers in, in the country. But they'll find out. I have a song with him, they'll find out, yeah. The show came about when when I, de I decided to start rapping again because I took like a five-year break after I had my first born son. And I was like, you know what, I'm going to dedicate my time to raising my boy, you know, because the first years are the most vital in a kid's life. So I was like, I'm going to give myself time to just chill at home and just take care of my kids. Oh. I decided, you know, I was, I, I, it wasn't on, at the back of my mind. But the, the thing that triggered it this time around was the death of an old friend of mine. Very huge. Huge's death was like a wake-up call for me. After we buried Huge, I was like, you know what, Katal, I'm really playing with my talent. I need to just put it out. And because of that, because of the death of a friend, I decided to call the show Mukocho and Friends. Or the three main things that we will address with the show is one, getting our names out there, getting more followers, just growing the movement. And two, we are trying to create mutually beneficial business relationships. You know, let's do business with each other, guys. We can't just be drinking and smoking J when we meet Kokone. Like, that can be the, the crux of our relationship. You know, let's add, let's add elements that will help us grow, you know? Right, let's get together and then let's build the relationships that will benefit us financially as well. So the guys on the lineup are like my actual friends, like for real, like no, no bullshit. Mind State, AKA Wule, Pulani Soul Natives, uh, Maitu's Beat, P, McP, Mike, Black Soul, Boy Wanda. First thing you benefit, you benefit the experience, it's getting to listen to uh, new music, different music, new artists, different artists, uh, and meeting people and making new friends, and being part of a movement that, that maybe 10 years from now will be talked about as something legendary. So this is our beginning. Come through, be friends with us from the beginning. Friendship is friendship is the glue that holds the world together.